slides in Excel. So first off, if you come into an Excel spreadsheet, you never see a cell that has a little red corner in the top right, that indicates that it has a comment attached to it. If you want to view the comment, usually you can just move your mouse over the cell and then it pops up the comment and you can of course read it. Uh, if you wanted to edit a comment, you would actually have to right click on the cell and choose edit comment and then it's going to put your cursor in there and you can make whatever change you'd want. Another interesting option with comments is to view them and you can find those options on the review tab. There's actually something here that says show all comments and what this does is it pops up any comments that you have within the spreadsheet. Now you can click and hold on a comment to move it because there is potential that two comments could be uh, over top of one another. And so what this allows you to do is it allows you to visually read all the comments in the spreadsheet in one go without having to move your mouse over the individual pieces. If I click the same button again on the review tab, show all comments, it just turns them off. So really the reason we're here is we want to learn how to insert new comments. We already know how to edit and move and view them or the general uh, ways to do that. What I'd like to know now is how to insert them. So to insert a comment, you can do this two ways. You could go to your review tab and you could choose new comment, assuming you've selected the cell that you want to add a comment for. Or you can right click on that cell and choose insert comment. This is usually the way I go. Once you've completed your comment, you can simply click away and the comment gets added. Now, to remove a comment, if you want to delete one, you can simply again right click on the cell, choose delete comment, or you could click the cell and then click the delete button in the comments group uh, on the review tab. When you do that, the comment gets removed and deleted. So that's some basics about working with comments. Now be sure to check out uh, another video that I have where we talk about modifying comment shape. And it sounds like such a silly thing, but there's actually a lot um, to it and a lot of useful features about that. So I'll link the video in the information section on the top of this video uh, and be sure to check that out because it's going to be very useful when you need to customize your comment shape.